welcome back to the farm. We're just at the workshop uh, greasing up our discs here, making sure that's ready to go. We're just going to disc the field that we combined. We have got one of our workers uh, doing another job um, that was drilling some early trial oilseed rape for a, some farming corporation in the, our, in the field opposite. Um, they have paid us £40,000 to do that, to drill that for them. And we've been paid that £40,000. the old TW30 out. So we'll start cultivating this field. Let's say our other employees just out there doing that drilling. Quite a big field out there, as you can see. So I think that's quite a good price for doing that, agreeing to do that. Gets a bit of money in. I don't know quite what would happen with it before, but it was a bit of a mess and just been left. say our other crops aren't quite ready yet so we've sort of got time to do this. Just get it cultivated ready for drilling when we need to. Try not to do too much ploughing. All night minimum tillage now. This is quite a good machine that was bought last year. This is the other one we had was knackered and we did really have to replace it. And it was only a three metre. So let's get this done.
that's it for that field. Is that done? Let's give this a quick wash. Yeah, wash by here. Because that has got absolutely filthy out there. Blasted a bit too hard. A lot of that paint's coming off now. Yeah, it's not looking too good anymore. So we'll pop this back here for a minute. that there. So we just come over in the JCB to um, top up with seed and our work is finished now. So we're just all going to go back, they're going to follow me. Yeah, so I think we'll just fill this back up so it's really full up for next time. leave that there for a minute. Put this drill away. move on to what we're going to do next now.
Ah, oh, good morning. I decided to um, have a little tinker in the workshop and tidy up a few bits and pieces yesterday. Um, and then went to bed early. Been quite busy lately. So it's the next morning here now. Um, our money's gone down a little bit for the hiring the lorry, etc. Uh, from when we done the crop the other day. And uh, we've had a bit of a bonus. We've had a £500,000 government subsidy come through. So we've got a bit of money at the moment. Or what looks to be a bit of money. Um, it's for, yeah, sort of stuff we need really. And servicing and paying wages. So it's not all to sort of go out and spend, spend, spend. Got to be a little bit careful, careful with it. Um, I did have a phone call overnight to say that a new class tractor has been introduced um, and there's an ex demo one for sale up at the dealers um, I was thinking I might go and have a look I know the TW30 is getting a bit tired now um, and all that paint that come off when it was washed it's just yeah not good really it's just not looking good uh, the TW10 is even worse off probably we're getting into the sort of time now where it's time to start looking at another tractor really um, I know class are quite good I know some other people around the place have had, had class and it's all quite good st stuff so I might just go out there and have a look anyway so we'll take this Land Rover today the posh one that we use for going out not the farm one I would have been out this morning and had a look around everything was alright. I haven't had any burglars overnight. I don't know quite what we're going to do the rest of the day because it says that it's going to rain later. Not sure of our crop, other crops already haven't been in a look at those yet. Yeah, so the class you've got is over over there, yeah. Right, so it's the it's the latest thing. It's just just out. It's an ex demo, and you're you're now trying to sell it. Yeah. Right. Okay. I'll have a look. Good Michelin tyres on it. All looks pretty much brand new. As it obviously is, it is brand new. There's a little bit of dirt on the tyres.
But I think you could replace the two Fords with that. I think that could do the work of two. I'm going to see how much they want for it. Yeah, how so how much would you how much would you want for it? New they're three hundred and forty five. But X demo you want you would say three hundred. Okay. Would you take how about if I pay you two hundred and eighty? right now yeah so they said yeah but uh, they're not cleaning it it's all it's all it's not to do a service or another 500 hours so um, it is it is what it is and they're, they're not going to clean it for 280 so I think we're just going to take our chances with that. I don't think it should be too bad. So I think we'll go with that. So there we go. And it goes out 280,000 and we have ourselves a new tractor. Um, so we'll come back and get that later I think in a bit let's go back to the farm and have a bit of a sort out I think we'll come back to that in a minute I think they're going to take some bits of ours. Um, I think we've decided we're going to keep that for now. Even though it is a bad state. We're going to get rid of the TW10 and this 8970 there's a couple of the workers don't like the steering on it and a few bits so Just grab another worker. Get them to follow us down the shop in this. So yeah, just follow us down. Like it's gonna rain now. That 
grass grew up quite quickly in those fields. Might be lucky enough to get a second cut there. So we'll just get these sorted out. And then we'll see right in a minute. Right, they're gone. We only got about sixty thousand pounds for the both of those. And ten of that was for the TW ten. But now we have this. A new era. brand new tractor on the farm for the first time in a very long time. I don't know if there's a bad sign or a good sign. Thunder. Have I done the right thing? Leave that there, might get a bit of a washout. I'm going to put this one now on the drill. This is now the drilling tractor, I think. That is a very smart tractor. I'm sure all the neighbours will be jealous. We'll either go and put this in a shed, we should have checked our crop first, shouldn't we? We'll either put this in a shed or we'll leave it out there ready to start. That's all ready to go. It just looks like 
from what that's saying at the weather forecast that it's going to rain all day so we'll have to wait until tomorrow now I suppose Just hitch that up to that trailer, ready for when we do need it. So I don't think there's much more we can do today now. So we can have a day of just tinkering around and we'll try again tomorrow. So until then, I'll catch you in the next one. Thanks for watching.